my faith was tested yesterday. We have to understand that when we believe in God for something, demons are going to try to destroy our faith in God. And we have to understand that demons can use people. Yes. When Jesus was telling the disciples that he was going to die, in so many words, he was saying that he was going to be crucified, that he was going to go through bad things. Peter said to him, in so many words, Jesus, no. Let that not happen. Now, what Peter said within itself was not bad, but Jesus Christ had to die for our sins. So what happened, Jesus Christ knew that Satan was using Peter. trying to persuade Jesus to not die when Jesus knew that he had to die for our sins in order for things to be the way that they are now so that we have the opportunity to go into heaven. So Peter only saw one side, not the overall view. You may be believing in something now, and some people may believe that they have your best interest in mind. But in truth, what is happening, they are destroying your faith in what you are believing in, in God. So they are exterminating your faith, believing that what they are believing in is more valid than what you are believing in, in God. We have to understand that everyone that serves God is not on the same level. The same level in faith as well. So in saying that, some people have higher faith, some people have lower faith. So why in the world would you listen to a person telling you what God is not going to do for you when they have lower faith in God than you? If anything, it makes much more sense to listen to a person with much higher faith. Your faith is going to be tested. And my faith was tested yesterday. I had to listen to people telling me what is not going to happen. When I told them what I am looking for, Kevin, that is not going to happen. Okay, now, so pretty much those people were against what I was believing in, believing in. But now they are seeing why I held on to what I was believing in. So sometimes some people are going to be against you. So be it. Even if you have to be alone, believing in what you are believing in, so be it. So what? Be alone. Listen. This life is a test. We are being tested in so many categories. So since you know that we are being tested, why are you going to listen to a person that is lower in faith than you? Think about that. Especially if they are saying, Kevin, God is not going to do that in so many words. Don't listen to that. People may say that God is limitless, but those people 
or some of those people may place a limit on God. Pretty much saying that God is going to work in this boundary. So you are placing a limit on God when you are saying that God is limitless. If you are not praying for anything sinful and you are obeying God, you can ask for what you will. Don't let anyone discourage you from what you want to believe in and God. With faith, everything is possible. Faith and obedience. So I pray that this makes sense. Have faith more in God than the advice of people. I pray that this makes sense. God bless you.